Right now, we're gonna show you how to make hand sanitizer. What's, What's up, up everyone? everyone? Welcome, Welcome back to Team Kello. What? Welcome to a very special video. It's on shortage right now, but this video is gonna help you make it at home so that you don't have to just throw the money down the drain, literally. And we're gonna simplify this video because there's a lot of videos out there that kind of tell you two thirds, three thirds, three four thirds. We're gonna show you and explain it. So what the portions mean for this concoction. Let's get to work. So as you can see here, we have a couple of ingredients. Uh, we're gonna focus on them a little bit. We have alcohol and it's very important that you get 70% rubbing alcohol. And it said that you have to use 60% or higher. Yes. In this case, we're using 70%. If you have 99%, it's even better. That's how you get the 99% in terms of. <laughs> we also have skin gel aloe vera. Um, it, this is not the, you know, lotion, this is, actual olive vera this is gel gonna, gel yeah this is what's going to make it so we have here some essential oils get whatever smell you like so that way you can you know your hands smell like such so and of course a little container here that i got a target which was probably like a dollar 25 and that's where we're going to put in our hand sanitizers so we also have the measuring cups here that we're going to be here. using this is basically for our formula. Obviously, they're not as big because we don't have a big container. If you have a bigger container, you'll have a bigger cup. So, are you ready? Yeah, let's go. Let's do it. Let's make some hand sanitizer. Alex, can you explain what are the actual percentages so they can understand the ratio between aloe vera and alcohol in whatever container they're using? Yeah, so it's very important that you measure 75% of the content should be alcohol the other 25 percent or one third of it should be aloe vera the reason why we're adding aloe vera is because it's soft for the skin i've already pre-measured this so i know it takes about uh one and a half cup of this so i'm gonna add just a little bit more so here's the rubbing alcohol right so then if i wanted to also i can measure something like this by tablespoon i know is about three and a half tablespoon to fill this up and so that means that it will probably be, you know, a tablespoon uh, to get of aloe vera. So, so yeah. here you go, the gel. So we do one and a half of yeah. aloe vera gel. All right, now this one looks slightly different the consistency, but that's just about how much you want to do, how much you want to use. So when you put it, you want to mix it well. Okay, thank you. The next thing, here we have a couple of different aroma essential oils. So you can choose whichever one you want. Uh, we're gonna go with lavender. Okay. With lavender. So you wanna do like four drops of that. Just shake it down. One, two, three, four. Okay, all right, cool, 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 cool. There you go. So then we're going to, once again, stir it up a little bit. All right, you may notice that this is a little watery per se. That's because this is a spray bottle. If you want a more gel-like consistency, then you need to add a little bit more of the aloe vera gel. We're gonna pour it up right in here. For this step, you normally would use a funnel. Or we, a colander. We couldn't find one, but you know, figure out which way works for you. Yep. Okay. There we go. So this is what we have right now. All right, ready? We'll put your hands out here. Let's see what's this here. Wow. And it does see? smell like alcohol. Um, I guess it depends on the essential oil. It smells just a little too much like uh, lavender. So we're gonna add a little bit of this one, which has a nice cool water scent. Okay. Okay. So you want to make sure that you get really sanitized. With it. Yeah, okay, that's fine. So if you look at any of the ingredients behind Purell and most of those other companies, they're about 70% alcohol. So just keep that in mind. So now you know, guys, thank you for watching this video. If you have any additional questions, please leave it in the comment below. Don't forget to like, comment, subscribe, and turn on the notification bell so that you don't miss any of our videos. So, signing out, Team, Team Kelo. Kelo.